you'll need to decide whether you want to insert your processor on the tape return path or on the channel path. The channel path allows us to insert a processor over a microphone when it is recording. This means your processor settings cannot be undone. Therefore, it is advisable to insert your processor on the tape return path where settings can be adjusted after the recording has happened. So in this example, we will insert a drama gate on the tape return path. Press insert in on the tape return section of the channel you wish to send to the compressor. Ensure the gain control for the compressor is set to 0 dB. Next on the patch bay, Patch send on the tape return path for that channel. Patch the other end of the cable into tie line 57. This is the input to our drama compressor. Using another patch cable, patch the output from the compressor to RET on the tape return path for that channel. This returns the output of the compressor into the tape return path. You have now inserted a compressor over the tape return path for that channel. Now adjust your compressor settings accordingly and adjust the output level to compensate for any loss in level. Note that inputs to outboard equipment are usually on the middle row of the patch bay with outputs on the top row. This rule applies to all outboard equipment unless otherwise stated.